he doesn't want to go away, y'all. Vince just refuses to just let bygones be bygones. He refuses to ride off into the sunset. No, 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 no. Vince is adamant about returning to WWE. This is his baby. This is his child. He can't leave it in good hands with Triple H. No, 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 no. Vince wants to return. Oh, man. I, I, oh, man. This is quite, uh, quite concerning. We're going to check this article out by the Wall Street Journal. This should be an interesting one. I, I couldn't even do the traditional intro because this is this is some scary news right here man let's get right straight into this article vince mcmahon plots return to wwe look at the picture look at the picture this is exactly how he would walk in on monday night raw if he was able to return the the, the same little walk oh my gosh oh 2023 starting off on a on a shaky foot man all right, Vince McMahon, the majority owner and former chief executive of WWE uh, Inc., uh, plans to return to the company following his retirement last year amid a misconduct probe uh, uh, to pursue a sale of the business. Mr. McMahon, uh, I can't even say his name, Mr. McMahon, who was majority voting power through his ownership I mean, who has majority voting power through his ownership of WWE's Class B stock, said Thursday he had told the company that he is electing himself and two former co-presidents and directors, Michelle Wilson and George Barrios, to the board confirming and uh confirming an earlier wall street journal report the move to reinstate mr mcmahon which the board previously rebuffed and the others will require three current directors to vacate their positions mr uh mcmahon whose abrupt departure in july 2022 followed disclosure by the journal of multiple payouts to women who had alleged sexual misconduct and infidelity expects he will be able to assume the role of executive chairman through uh though he would need board approval for that the the people said it isn't uh clear where that would leave his daughter stephanie mcmahon after his departure she took over uh as chairwoman and co-ceo alongside nick khan the company's former president wwe shares rose more than 10 percent in extended trading thursday on 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 the news mr mcmahon 77 years old sent a letter to the wwe boards in late december detailing his desire to return to the company we did talk about that um last year uh he ran for four decades to help guide a strategic review process according to people uh, familiar with the matter Mr. McMahon thinks that uh, there is a narrow window to kick off a sale process because WWE's media rights, uh, including uh, for its flagship program Raw and SmackDown, are about to be renegotiated according to the people. Mr. McMahon thinks the media landscape is evolving quickly and more companies are looking to own the uh, intellectual properties they use on their streaming platforms, making WWE an attractive takeover uh, target, the people said. WWE, which generates most of its revenue from selling content rights, posted its first year over a billion dollars in revenue. Say this again, over a billion dollars in revenue in 2021 the company had a market value of just more than five billion dollars as of thursday close which makes sense because vince loves his billion dollar baby and he wants to come back to make sure it continues to keep growing the board responded last month in a letter to mr grimman that it was prepared to initiate a review process and would welcome working with him on it good god However, it said it unanimously agreed that Mr. McMahon return to the business wouldn't be in the shareholders' best interest, according to people familiar with the letters. 
The board also asked Mr. McMahon to confirm his commitment to repay expenses incurred by WWE related to an investigation that uh, investigation of all allegations and requested that he agree not to return to the company during government probes of the matter, the people said. Mr. McMahon said in a response that he remains willing to continue working to complete any reimbursement for a reasonable expenses related to the investigation to extent uh they aren't covered by the insurance but he declined to agree not uh to uh but he declined to agree to not return to the company he has committed to the board that unless he has direct involvement as uh, as executive chairman from the outset of a strategic review he won't support or approve any media deals or sales the people say oh boy oh oh yeah he's yeah, he's he 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 trying to come back for real for real. He's basically saying since he has uh that uh still the majority vote shares or whatnot, he won't approve any media rights once these deals come back up or whatnot, because they obviously have to renegotiate some contracts with Fox and USA. He's pretty much saying, I ain't I ain't approving that until y'all reinstate me. Oh Lord. Oh boy, <laughs> Mr. McMahon retired as WWE Chief Executive uh, and Chairman uh, in July and amid a board investigation of sexual misconduct. Uh, I think we read all of these. Uh, yeah, all of this extra information, this is uh, something we heard. Uh, well, we've already uh, discussed. WWE's board ultimately found that the payments through made by Mr. Uh, Mr. McMahon personally should have been booked as WWE uh, uh, should have uh, should have been booked as WWE's expenses because they benefited the company. Mr. McMahon had told people that he intended to make a comeback at WWE. The Journal reported last month. He said that he received bad advice from people close to him last year to step down, according to people familiar with the comments. All right. So what I got from this article is pretty much Vince is like, you motherfuckers gonna let me back. Simple as that. But when it comes to these renegotiation for the the sales and the rights of the media uh, for WWE, we ain't having none of that. Oh, man. <laughs> I'm gonna be honest with you. When someone owns majority of the shares, they still can make some moves. They still can make some plays. Now, the board doesn't have to agree to have him back. But once again, when it comes to those uh, media shares and uh, media sales, you know, that's that's big money for WWE. I don't know. There's a good chance, y'all. Vince McMahon may actually be able to come back in WWE. Now, the question is. Will he be in charge of the day-to-day -day activities, what we see on television? Um, I don't know. Granted, I feel like if he's back in just a corporate sense, it's still kind of an issue for the day-to-day -day stuff because you know, you know Vince is going to have his inputs and have his little, you know, meetings with Triple H to suggest some things. You, you can't. You can't be, you know, that naive to not think, oh, well, he's only doing the corporate side of things. No, it's Vince. This is his baby. I'm pretty sure he's probably been sick at home watching his baby, quote unquote, get destroyed in his eyes. You know, why? Why is Bailey over there supporting Sasha Banks in a in New Japan Pro Wrestling? Why are they taking pictures together on social media? Oh, this is this is awful. Oh, get this get this off my screen. What happened to my baby, Austin Theory? What's going on with him? He's not the same, Austin Theory. Where's his money in a bank briefcase? Oh, oh. All jokes aside, this is quite terrifying. Quite terrifying. Vince may actually be making his return. And from what this article says, if if he has that type of power play within the company still because he owns majority shares, and when it comes to these negotiations for these networks and their media rights, he can say no. Unless you reinstate me, put me back as chair, chairman or whatever. So, I don't know. This is quite 
interesting. I, I really don't, I, I don't know what's going to happen here. So comment down below. Let me know. Are you guys as worried as I am? <laughs> Vince McMahon is going to come back and all of a sudden we're going to start seeing uh, some, some more Vince uh, McMahon light booking. Because good God, we have seen some in the past couple months, not as bad as it used to be. But I, I do think if he is able to come back, oh boy, best believe uh, we may see some gimmicks that uh, we were hoping were long gone. <laughs> so comment down below. Let me know if you guys are just as worried as I am. <laughs> but I am still your undisputed YouTube wrestling champ of the world. I appreciate y'all kicking in with me. And I see y'all on the next one. Peace.